Hi bestie and welcome to this vlog. I don't know what vlog number this is, probably covered in Simon hairs too but you know what 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 is new. I'm also covered in Gracie hairs as well you just can't see them on the black. This vlog for me is due out in about three weeks. Today's date is, let me just get the date, today's date is Tuesday February the 13th. Today I'm doing a live because it's a Tuesday and I am uh, packing these for the first time. These are the 6k challenges so made a couple of those. At the moment I'm really far ahead on videos, like so far ahead in fact that t maybe tomorrow I'm going to edit a video for my other channel, Don't Trust Ira, which I think is going to be wonderful. And at the moment over there we've got more than a hundred channel members. The membership price is 99p and people have been so kind and so gracious. They've gifted memberships to other people so we've got like a load of members at the moment. So what I think I'm going to do is capitalise on that at the moment and do a video for that other channel so that they can see it earlier before everybody else. And I think it's going to be a good thing because, you know, if they like the video, like the style of video, then potentially they might stay a member. And also I am talking with somebody and we're going to get some custom emotes like the hand drawn, like they, they so far what I've seen really really nice but you're not here on this video to hear me talk about my other channel so not much on today I do need to pack some orders so I'll do that with you in a second but also I'm just trying to get ahead of stuff because I know that very very soon I'm going to be moving and I need to take a couple days out of budget with Ira out of packing order so I need to be as far ahead as I possibly can and orders have slowed down at the moment so it's like perfect time to really get as far ahead as I possibly can so that I'm able to take that time out of the business and you know spend some time with Jake before he moves to Australia all of that stuff so yeah that's what I'm up to. I'm also waiting on some bits to arrive so when they do arrive I'll show you like the two new items but you know the pizza pizza challenge they are going out to the sugar daddies these are like what's going to go in the back sugar daddy mail so I'm just waiting on two so that I don't like waste a ton of money on postage I've already paid for the postage but I'm just waiting on those two to arrive so that I don't have to sort of waste money but yeah this intro is a bit of nothing I have literally waffled so I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and pack orders and then I'll meet you afterwards for something a bit more interesting yeah
Christy, how is it going? How are you? Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. Today is Wednesday the 21st of February. It's seven o'clock at night and um, a lot's going on at the moment, basically. So I am in the middle of moving and I didn't really anticipate how how difficult it was going to be like i'm a little mess i'm covered in cat hair uh i am moved in to my new place uh with my brother jake stuff is mostly stored so the worst is over i haven't really done any work like with the business in since like saturday so i feel really behind on orders and i also feel really behind on youtube as well so i don't know where i'm at <sighs> okay everything for this week is filmed and recorded including sunday's video so what i'm actually filming for now is vlog 51 which isn't this weekend it's the weekend after so that's all good i've got a lot going on at the moment <laughs> Life feels really, really difficult. I actually had to cancel last Tuesday's live because I just, we just moved the cats in and they were struggling. Like they're just, they're still struggling now. Like they hate adapting to change it like any cat does. So I just wanted to be there with them. And then I've had to be out moving stuff, but I think I'm gonna do the live tomorrow. So tomorrow for me, I'm going to Ikea. I've got some stuff planned for in here and I'll talk to you about that tomorrow. But today, if you can see behind me, there is a mountain, mountain of things that I need to open up and check and all sorts of stuff. So there's a lot of stuff. So we're going to go open that together. But I wanted to get in here just to feel like I'm still in the swing of things. I don't think I'm going to be able to fulfill any orders until Monday again. So I'm fully taking a week out of the business and I feel so blessed that I'm able to do that. But I need to check Etsy and make sure do you know what I cleared it down really really nice the um last time I did it on Saturday so yeah I think I'll be okay I'm gonna do a couple orders on Thursday because there's some binders I need to ship so I'll do packing uh tomorrow anyway but uh, I think uh, I just wanted to sort of drop in and update you because right now I feel really really blessed that I worked really really hard <laughs> in order to make this happen so the next video I need to do is uh february check-in four obviously i'm taking jake to the airport on sunday so i kind of want to spend as much time with him as i can so um tomorrow is kind of half business day half uh work day because uh, i need to go get some stuff for my room so i need a wardrobe and stuff like that but uh, i've got some plans for the office as well that i need to try and make happen so i'll tell you all about that tomorrow when i have had a shower where i look reasonable uh maybe <laughs> my I even managed to get my hair cut in the morning uh but yeah i'm gonna crack on because there's so many parcels to open i thought i'd film that and share that with you so let's go ahead and open some parcels then you don't have to look at my ridiculous face and hair and catness and then i will see you shortly okay so this is <laughs> a lot of parcels but i feel like this angle is probably the best one to go for i don't actually know what any of this stuff is <laughs> to go to the dump tomorrow so this is why i need to sort out my cardboard uh oh okay lovely so what i've got here is i've got a reprint of the 200 envelope challenge so uh there's just 100 reprints of those so they are fantastic they're on the same 200 gsm card that i like so um yeah all look pretty good to me okay cool Parcel one is done. So here we've got an Amazon parcel. What have I got in here? I have no idea what I've ordered. Okay, right, okay, boring stuff. Right, I've got labels. So these are for my, like, uh, what are they called? Uh, address labels. So they'll go over here. And then I've got this, that's handy. These are the gold uh, scratch off stickers and then I've got some of these here those are um ugh, I've lost my words today these are the uh mailers for really big packages uh because I'd run out of the larger ones so lovely bit of cardboard gonna get recycled tomorrow okay another one from Amazon can you see let me just move the camera another one from Amazon 
we have got, oh, teal tissue paper. That's going to come in really handy. These are for the beginner bundle box for the Teal With It collection, which hopefully has released by the time this video comes out. What's in here? Okay. Oh, lovely. Okay, so these are the new uh, Teal With It uh, receipt backs. Uh, feels like I've ordered enough this time. Um, this is good. Okay, so this month we're going for obviously teal in the background and we've got colour in the task. So it's like stuff that you just need to teal with, like deal with. Um, yeah, that looks nice. Okay, cool. I'm going to put that on my thing in a sec. This is Amazon, I believe. What is this? I, I just don't even know what I've ordered at this point. <laughs> I feel so lost and out of touch. Okay, lovely. So these are not the cheapest way to get hold of these. I'm not going to lie. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So they go in the beginner bundle uh, set for the teal collection. So I've got all of those. What have I got here? This is Amazon. Oh yeah. The things I hate buying. <laughs> so this is 150. But like I go through about 100 of these a week. So 150 of those. So I'm just going to file these away and pretend I'm not overpaying for them. Next 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 so this is plastic so i need to put this somewhere else okay oh lovely bit of these oh, okay cool so these are the teal with it cash totals um i actually asked for a hundred this time so <laughs> i like at least i've got them because people like buying them um so I get enough requests for them. So yeah, these ones here, they look nice, actually. Pretty pleased with these. Oh, this one's a big one. Right. So, uh, oh, nice. So these are the Teal With It um, uh, Paycheck Bill Tracker Pads. So I get a lot of requests for the Paycheck Bill Tracker Pads in the collection. So instead of ordering the normal amount, I ordered double this time uh, because I keep on running out of them. So we'll see how long these last. So these are the Teal With It ones. And if they sell well, I'll just continue to order this amount going forward. So yeah, so a lot of them there. That's, uh, that's heavy, bestie. Okay, what's this in here? <laughs> Oh, look, new savings challenge. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to be released by the time you... Yeah, it should be released by the time you're watching this. Uh, but we've got the autumn baking and the ginger snap challenge. Um, I just like to open them and make sure that they are okay. Um, yeah, they look okay. They are nice and thick. Just need cutting up. Perfect. This is light. I have no idea what's in this one. What on earth is it? What did I order? So these are the teal. These were supposed to be like Tiffany's color and they literally look blue to me. Um, they don't look, oh, I'm a bit disappointed with them. But I suppose when I get that, like, well, they are quite blue, aren't they? But I, I suppose, I suppose it's the best I can do. They were supposed to be like, they're literally marketed as aqua, but uh, they looked a lot tealer in the picture, but I've got them now. So yeah, these ones are for the beginner bundle box. We're going for a new size. So a smaller size, so they're easier to ship. So I've got these now, which is fantastic. And then obviously I've got bubble mailers, which I always need, always got them. <laughs> okay, so in terms of what I need for the beginner bundle box i still need the thicker zipper thing so they need to get cut out and i know that's on its way to me i'm waiting for some stickers as well for the teal collection and also for the autumn baking and the ginger snap savings challenge 
uh, and then I've got everything, so I will be okay. So I'm waiting for a couple more deliveries. Um, tomorrow I'm going to Ikea, so I'm going to be doing that. So tomorrow you'll see a fresher me will be in here and we'll be talking about what I want to do. And then also uh, we'll start getting back into the swing of packing orders uh, very, very soon. But uh, I need to tidy up all of this stuff, get this cardboard ready to go, to the recycling center tomorrow and i will see you very very soon bestie i'll fill you in on everything that's going soon like it's been wild so bestie <laughs> literally everything that i told you was gonna happen it still happened right but i have had just the most difficult it was such a difficult week this week so today's day is um, Sunday the 25th and I'm driving Jake to the airport so we can go to Australia in two hours but I've got a two hour window so let me tell you what's actually happened so far because it has been just a wild week so I've moved from my house I've helped Jake move his stuff so he's got stuff in storage I've also helped him pack um, we've done all sorts of stuff run loads and loads of errands and I've also been to Ikea twice oh my god been to Ikea, Ikea twice uh, my rooms are looking great not gonna show you that because you know I like a bit of privacy I've got I've got stuff going on so I went to Ikea because I bought myself a wardrobe I wanted a single wardrobe I managed to buy a three like a triple wardrobe so i had to go back it's a nightmare let me just show you what this office looks like i mean i'm just gonna pick you up from here and uh, <laughs> what a mess starting off in this corner that's not really changed uh but i've upgraded my desk i've taken two of the legs off which i was actually supposed to take uh, away to a charity shop i've now got a desk um here's that um this has been moved and look at everything on top of it and if you look in the corner here um i've got two new shelves the budget with Ira has fallen off because I've moved it and I've moved a shelf there. So now I've got more storage space, but um, Power Rangers are still in the corner. But basically what I want to do now is start to tackle this because Bestie, she is, she, she is fully a mess. She's fully a mess. Right, press record up there. Okay. <laughs>
Okay, so this is where I'm at. <laughs> a lot's happened, but not a lot has happened. So we've still got just beyond trash everywhere, but I had to stop and take Jake to the airport. It's now the next day and um, we are looking messy, bestie. But you can start to see what this whole sort of corner is supposed to be. So like, that's that's like a good fair bit of extra storage so what i've got right now is like mats on the floor <laughs> just stuff everywhere the stuff on my desk i'm planning to put into look at that just cables um we've got another desk here and that's kind of for filming that can sort of move anywhere um yeah and then there's boxes underneath so i told you they take up a lot of space and i've still got more up here as well so really what the plan is right now is to just sort of put things in the place that i want them to i've got the budget with iris sign that needs to go up here um yeah i've just got stuff that needs to find a place and it needs a good cleaning out so i think that's my plan for now so yeah essentially this is what i'm wearing today i mean <laughs> and uh i just need to get this place sorted one thing i do need to tell you is that uh mason has died she has exposed ink everywhere so she has uh being terminated but i really really need to get some orders done probably starting tomorrow so i need to get this place sorted so i've got a camera here i've got a camera here and one all the way over there so um it's time to get cracking bestie <laughs>
done in my drawers sorry if the camera angle just now was bad i really need to sort out that okay right so in the top we have the things that i grab for the most like blades and other bits and bobs i've got all my black pens in here rulers note things just stuff that i grab a lot that i don't really want on the desk so that's in that nice shallow one and what was really good is these that i've had for such a long time I've gone from primark for like one pound fifty each they fit really nice so there's that in the second drawer is things that i need less regularly so we've got stickers we've got my label writer uh, we've got spare ink and that's what we've got remaining but i have got new stickers coming soon so uh that's okay and then here we've got stuff that i just i, I need relatively regularly but like not as often so we've got like um stickers like scratch off stickers stuff like that these will be coming in to use really really soon these are just colored envelopes they're going to be for my hundred well the the first hundred envelopes of my 200 envelope challenge under here is like supplies so these are address labels these are happy mail stickers we've got some bin bags that i use quite regularly um like a turntable stuff like that and in the very bottom is where i keep sort of paper and stickers so here's circle stickers there's square ones there's paper there's um all sorts in here um and it's super super handy so i'm glad that i did that it's all sort of out of the way but i know i've got other stuff somewhere else like i know i've got thicker paper and i don't know where it is so i don't know where that's gonna go but yeah wish me luck bestie because um she's still an absolute tip so i'm always done it's really dark hi really dark but let me show you what i've done so <laughs> here i am i still need to sort out this sort of section i've got some bits here that shouldn't really be here but it's okay i've moved the um cutter a bit more towards the door there's not much walking room but it's it makes it easier because i can now access these bottom bits here so uh here's what it looks like i feel like i kind of need to step back a bit to show you what i've got so 
here is the first tower. We have got all of the collections. So we've got pink paisley, perfect purple, seize the day, teal with it, and then the next collection, and then so on, so on, so on, right? Here, I'm just kind of using that as a sort of in tray, but I will use it for storage when I need it, but I don't need it at the moment. Then this hasn't changed. It's got the 101 savings challenges here. So there they are there. I love looking at it from this angle here. <laughs> so you can see all of the colours. So beautiful. Then we have got the beautiful uh, binders that we've got in stock at the moment. Uh, I'm going to get rid of that chair, I think. Uh, then I have moved these. So these are the scratch off challenges here. So you'll notice there's a gap in between each of them. That's because I'm planning on designing some. They'll fit in between those and they'll be coming out shortly. And the, um, then there's a gap there for three. So I've got three more ideas that I'm going to sort of bring out. So there's that. Underneath that, we've got the sticker challenges and I've just cut out all the new ones. So the ones that are new to me are the autumn baking one and the the ginger snap one um, there are two that have just been designed so they are off at the printers now then there's space for another set of sticker challenges that I've got planned and then I've got room for more sort of saving challenges stickers just room for it which is just lovely to have so there'll be like uh, a series and it all just makes sense um, up here we have got the dice challenges uh, notice that save 200 is going to need a bit more space than any others. Uh, then I've got room here for the uh, uh, rainbow mega dice challenge, the mermaid and the nude. I've got the dice there just waiting for my zippers. Then we've got fortune, save 6k, solo, infinity. Uh, and I'm just waiting for zippers for those. Then this will be where wildcard will be. And then we've got a future savings challenge there, which we're going to really look forward to. Then we've got all the dashboards there. And then there are two more rows for future dashboards. So I'm going to design a ton more dashboards. Um, they'll be coming up very, very shortly. We've got the heads and tails under there and then all of the dividers. So that's what these ones look like. So try and be like <laughs> not doing this so you don't like... <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, so over here, well, on top of here, I've put these because they're really big and obnoxious and um, they're fine. So I've got the A4 pads. We've got the 200 envelope challenges that are back in stock with the stickers. And these are save 6K. Um, then up here, we've got uh, like things that are just a bit too tall and don't sell as fast as they used to. We've got Saving Challenge Volume 2. We've got the 35, 52, 26 and 100 envelope challenge. We've got the uh, cash trays. We've got them. And then we've got these. And as you can see, um, what I'm planning to do is sell through these binders. They're like the slowest selling ones and then have others in there. So as the next collection comes out, we'll just have more. At the moment, this is where I'm going to store these. I've got more under the desk down there, um, but that's where they're going to be at the moment because they take up just so much space. But I've got one shelf there and I need four more. One, two, three, four. One, two. Yeah, I need four more shelves and then I'll be all right. And then here, this is not a permanent place for them, just stuff that I've got very, very low volume of that will still soon and then it'll make up the space so we've got like just some a7s we've got some um the expense trackers there's only three left off we've got the seize the day a5s um then we've got these just things that i don't have like a huge run of do you know what i mean and then there's space so these weekly monthly sticker sets should be selling shortly we've got cash totals there so just stuff that i don't have like massive uh, amounts of so yeah tons and tons of space to grow the desk is looking really really good so yeah looking really good so over here we are cutting out the what are they called the for the dice challenges just so that they're ready for when the challenges come and what I want to do tonight is just deal with these last ones here even though I've currently just sent off to be printed the next collection so January, February, March, April, May, May 
yeah, May stuff. I've just sent off and printed. I just need to finish these off. There's 16 more boxes to make. I just need to make them. Um, some of them will fit under there, but some of them will have to go under here. But other than that, I just need to get them out of my head. And then tomorrow is the day where I start filming the collection for the teal, teal with it. Like, Bestie, I can't even express how kind of guilty I feel that I haven't actually sent out the video for what the teal collection is going to be. So patrons are supposed to get it. I say you get early access, so it's still going to be early. Even if it's one day early, it's still early, right? But I like to give you a week. I like to give patrons a week, but just this week has I just didn't I just didn't anticipate what this week was going to look like for me so yeah it's really it's really bad um in my eyes anyway but uh, I will have that video up and done um and it doesn't even have to be a video I can just share pictures do you know what I mean and if, you know I'm thinking oh that's what I might do but I just don't want to cop out I want to do a nice video but um that's what I'm going to do uh, tomorrow. But tonight, there's a couple of things that I need to do. And that is, I need, what was it? I need to do my budget because I just got paid like my fifth paycheck of the month. So I need to do my budget because tomorrow needs to be a filming day. So tomorrow I really do need to film um, that video. I need to film my check-in, my budget bestie, uh, and then videos I don't know if you've seen yet or not. So there's like... A cup like two or three um videos i need to film so uh well three or four or five actually so i've got to do that i've also got a cart coming tomorrow like one of those like carts that's going to be better for me for packing so i'm gonna do that with you probably so plenty to do i'm sorry to show you everything but i just kind of got a bit stressed and now this room feels absolutely brilliant like look at all of this it just feels I just feel so much better. Like, I like having space available to me. Um, but knowing me, I am going to fill it up. So hopefully, I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully, I would have had a haircut. Hopefully, I would have had a shower. Hopefully, I'm taking better care of myself. But there's a couple of bits I want to do tonight. And um, yeah, I need to do I need to do that. Yeah. All right. Okay, cool. See you later, bestie. So I was just about to weed these ready for tonight's live and I opened up my Amazon parcels and I was really, really furious because I thought that I was going to get like a load of binders that I had ordered because I'm furious about binders, ordering them. I hate the fact that I have to order them. Um, but look what arrived. And I thought this was like so nice. So someone must have heard me talking about how I wanted a like planner set. Um, on one of my lives and I don't know how they've managed to do it because this was not on my Amazon wish list but they've managed to order it like I don't know how it's possible but apparently it is like they don't know my address or anything but look at this um <laughs> I was talking about how I wanted to get one and look what was sent to me I just thought it was so cute and it's pretty much exactly what I was after like there's like a little notebook here and then there's things to do today and it's got Sunday Monday Tuesday Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday and then notes so I am definitely going to use this I don't know about the stickers but oh they feel lovely they're so glittery oh I like how are they made Oh, they're, oh, look, done. I'm definitely going to use these. How cool. And it's got all these, like, little things here. I absolutely, this is so nice. Whoever sent this to me, I don't know who sent it to me because it was, like, um, it was, like, anonymous or whatever. But thank you so much. That's so, so, so kind. But I'm definitely using, this is the best part of it. I'm definitely using that. And then also this arrived. Let me zoom you out a bit. So this arrived, and this is something I ordered yesterday after tidying up the office uh, because I've got basically what I call a corner of crap <laughs> in the office. And I'll show you how I'm going to use it. But this is um, essentially one of those rolling carts. I went to Hobbycraft because there's a new one that opened up in the town where, well, near where I live. Um, and they were a bit cheaper in there, to be honest. So I hope this one's okay. But um, I got this one and yeah she looks all right I wanted a white one and yeah she looks all right so I'm gonna go ahead and make her I can't believe my eyes when I get close to you close to you close to you you said hello and I lost my control in just one tiny second you do to me what I've seen in the movies but this really
So this cut here, she's designed to go in this sort of cubby. So what I wanted is because she's got three drawers, right? So I wanted the top drawer to be like packing stuff because I do that stuff every day. Underneath it would be like making stuff. So things that I use to make cash envelopes and stuff like that. And at the bottom, the things I need every now and then for video. So like my binders and stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and start packing this. Maybe I'll zoom you out a bit so you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to start with the top drawer with the packing stuff and hopefully it works out. Okay, this is it i think it's done it's a bit messy if i'm honest but like it's my messy stuff so of course it is so we've got the packing stuff here i've got my a4 my a5 and my dl cellos i've got my two types of tape that i use i've got those that go with vinyl happy mail stickers and we know we've got spares i've got dice because sometimes you order dice and then under here we've got making stuff so stuff to make cash envelopes really this might actually stay up which i think it will actually um and then I've got hole punches there, like the three different sizes that I use. Uh, and then under here is stuff for filming. So yes, I think it's looking good. And if we push her, she fits actually quite nicely. So I am pleased with that, Bestie. Hi, Bestie. Um, how are you? I've just finished editing the vlog. Um, today is Saturday the 16th of March and uh, we're about a month after I filmed all of that stuff and um, since then I haven't filmed anything. I'm literally trying to get comfortable. I'm on my bed uh, in my room. Um, I'm just gonna get comfortable so I can talk to you. So I look an absolute mess but I, I just need to talk to you about stuff like something like quite serious really. Um, you, I don't know if you've really noticed because but it's something that I've been like quite aware of and quite um it's been on my mind like I've had a bit of like a creative paralysis recently where hi <laughs> um where I just haven't really got anything done really so this vlog was supposed to be out like a long time ago do you want to move so this vlog was supposed to be out a long time ago and I've postponed it twice. Oh, just hog all the attention. Come on then. Yeah, I've postponed it twice. 
just because it's not been ready. But like, honestly, there was nothing I really needed to do to it. I could have made it shorter in some sections and stuff like that. I've just had a bit of paralysis. And what I've noticed through editing is that that was a very, very long sort of decline in mental health. I feel like I'm coming through the other side of it now. My mental health declined and I feel worse but I continue working because for me stopping what I'm doing is never helpful uh, for a couple of reasons like number one is that if I allow myself to get into a pit of not being productive then I will stay in that indefinitely and the person that gets me out of that is Jake who was in Australia. So I can't really have that to rely on anymore. So I have to sort of get myself out of these situations. So being productive and getting as much done as possible is usually really, really helpful. But because I don't have anybody to kick my bum uh, and make me make my bed, like my bed is made, like I'm, I'm doing okay, I'm doing okay. Like I see comments a lot of the time that are like, you know, your videos really, really help me. Uh, they really help me get out of my depression. And so I feel a massive responsibility to remain positive and to make sure that I don't really have a gap. And like yesterday's video, like Friday's video didn't happen. I had to move Saturday's extra video into Friday. And I cannot, honestly, I cannot remember the last time that I left like didn't have a video ready like sometimes I'll film it and edit it that morning um but yeah so and when I look back at this vlog the unbelievable change that has happened in my life in the last month is absolutely wild like it is absolutely like you know my whole surroundings are different like everything's just so different but like I've got my babies I've got my cats with me and yeah I'm doing really well so this is kind of like an outro to this vlog and to be honest this is the weirdest vlog because there's no packing um so much has like happened like I'm talking about the teal with it collection like I filmed it so long ago so yeah it's quite nice to see what's been really good for me today is I've been able to see you know just looking at myself like I'm I'm not 100% happy like the whole time and I can sort of see myself getting a little bit worse really stressed over small things but it's good that I'm sort of feeling like I can overcome it like by myself which is a really really good thing because I've never really felt like that before. I guess the sorts of things that I haven't really shown you is all of the really really hard work I've been putting into the business uh, in the background. We've got some insane changes and some insane things coming out and I'm literally I you know I don't like to especially the way I'm feeling right now I don't like, I'm not the type of person that's gonna over promise stuff but I am actually gonna blow your socks off uh with the stuff that is coming out really soon so uh, and when I say really soon I mean like in the next six months because we've got some you know I'm about to really really do some great things with this business and I'm, I'm really really excited so you know just thank you for like being part of that journey and like supporting me through it but also I have been working on myself and you know if anything has taught me anything is I don't have to go a million miles a second I can take days to myself even if that's only half a day and the other thing that I've realized for myself that being calling yourself a workaholic is not a badge of honor because like the most of the aholics it is a bit of an issue so for me being a workaholic is not always a healthy thing so I need to take a step back sometimes so yeah um I do need to <laughs> I have got a lot of stuff to do I do need to do some filming today and not like this with my hair this greasy so I will get on and do stuff so I am going to end the video here and I and I don't really know what the point of me saying what I have been saying this to you but like I think you know it's the, the besties that have been around for a long time you're probably going to be watching this vlog and be like is he okay? And I just want to say, yes, I am okay. I'm doing really, really well. I'm feeling loads better. And just being able to take a day to edit something from my room is like just lovely. So 
while I do have to crack on with stuff tonight, I probably won't. And I'll probably, yeah, I probably will actually. Yeah, I will. <laughs> this hair is winding me up. So uh, thank you so much for getting through to the end of the video. You know I love it when you get through to the end of the video. Please give this video some love. Make sure you like, comment, share and subscribe. And if you are going to comment, please use this emoji. I hope you enjoy the vlogs and I hope this one wasn't disappointing because it's different to the others. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, uh, I can see Simon to my left, but I think he's a bit camera shy. But obviously, you know, my daughter, she isn't. So she's happily sat on my lap there. And I, I guess that's the end of today's video. So just thanks for being here. Thank you for giving me a reason to make a vlog because I don't think I would have really noticed what has been happening to me unless I had edited this. So yeah, just thanks so much. And I guess I'm going to leave it here. Don't trust Iron and all that. And I guess what I'll do is I'll leave you with this playlist because this has got all of the vlogs I've ever done. We're at vlog 51. And that means that the next vlog, we've definitely been doing vlogs for over a year. There's been gaps. There's been all sorts going on. And, you know, I hope to bring you a vlog every month. Uh, and next vlog definitely will have lots and lots and lots of packing in it because I know that's what you like to see. So, um, yeah. Bye bye, bestie.